Hey everyone, welcome to the ninth video in my Splatoon 3 map callout series. Um, I'm making these videos to learn map callouts and also try to help others learn them as well while I learn them. I'm using the Splatoon 3 community callouts uh, maps for this and I will include a link in the description so that you can follow along if you like. Um, today we are looking at Inkblot Art Academy and the map for this is using tower control um, and the locations on the map should be largely similar for all the versions but where they differ I will talk about them. Um, so let's get into it so again we start at spawn and from spawn we have this area this is labeled as the slick here then this area here, there's a note that in Rainmaker and Tower Control, this is called the goal. For other modes, uh, it doesn't give a name. So perhaps you could call it the, the same thing, the goal. But if we go back up, this area here is called the alley. This whole area here is the alley and right here is the drop yeah actually no I slightly messed that up so this is the alley well, there are two alleys here, because you can also go this way, and this would be called the alley, wouldn't it? And this is the drop. So, what should we call this? It doesn't have a label. Um, maybe, like, it could be called the right alley and this is the left alley it doesn't really have a label but this is the drop and then here this area is called the tree yeah the tree and we go up into the tree from the tree and from our perspective this is called the left stack here and this area down here is called mid now in splat zones there's going to be this stack in the middle here where this t the tower is and this is going to be called top mid like at the top of the tower it's also there in turf war this like central thing and then these left stack and right stack over here this is right stack are going to be smaller um in splat zones and in turf war so this central stack is going to be called top mid here we have um the right stack and from the right stack we have the wall right here oh no that's not the wall my bad sorry um, this is the uh, choke and this is the wall this is the wall right here the area I'm walking around right now is called plat And this funky thing is called the shell. 
or it's also there's a note it's also referred to as the foot here is the attic the goal again we go up the slick into the spawn and from the spawn we drop down into this area called bats so this is bats and this thing up here is the perch and this thing here this area here is labeled the booth and this area is called the snipe and I don't know I don't remember if I covered it but this here is called the attic right here so the maps again are symmetrical so let's go through and walk in the other direction and name all the areas as we walk through them so starting in the attic our attic drop down this is the goal drop down in the goal walk down into plat stand behind the wall walk down the choke and up the right stack into mid we walk down to the tree and into the drop back to the tree, up into mid, up their choke. Here we have the wall again. We can walk up to the snipe, the booth, bats, the perch, the shell or the foot, we'll jump across bats into the goal, from the goal we can go to the attic, then the goal up into spawn, And here is the alley. And I think that, again, we can call that like maybe left alley and right alley, perhaps. That makes sense to me. So this is just alley, left alley, right alley. Left alley and right alley are not on the map, but these two locations seem distinct to me. So we'll go down left alley and into the drop where the tree is. Thanks for watching.